So to mitigate the shortcomings of a scatter plot, we can plot the same data as a line chart and connect the dots with lines, as we see in this image. Putting lines here really emphasizes trends. So we can see that there was a pretty bad series of Red Sox teams in the 90s, and that the Red Sox teams have been doing pretty well in the 2000s. It's a little bit harder to see this when we just have the points without the lines. That being said, having lines that connect each point really puts a focus on year-to-year -year variability. We can see, for example, that from 1964 to 1965 there was a huge drop, but it's a little bit harder to have a good sense of the more global trends. Are the teams getting better or worse on average? For this reason, we might introduce a lowest curve instead of these lines. 